What's going on, guys? Welcome back to another Guilds of Ravnica draft. And Venerated Loxodon is what we have up in this up in this piece. I think if you're going to go Celestia, this is a pretty good card to pick. But there are very two very good blue commons, uncommons, and a very good black blue common. Other than that, though, I think Venerated Loxodon's probably better. Mon Predic, what's up? Tell New Zealand I said hello. He might have a heart problem. I know he's super lazy. He would come home from work and just sleep and lay around so he had to go to work. Turns out he had a heart problem, which caused his blood flow a lot slower or something like that. And how to get... Sur oh my god, really? That's interesting. We're going to take this guy. There's also like only one other white card, so maybe that comes back. I don't know. This is also very good in both Boros and Celestia, so that's fine. Man, Expansion Explosion. What's the name of the town you guys live in? We live in Clearwater. It's uh, It's in Florida. It's near, it's like 10 minutes from Tampa, 15 minutes from Tampa, so. Ha, da, da. Also, today is our first day uh, officially promoting MeUndies. So if you guys are looking for sweet underwear, socks, lounge pants, tees, etc., you can check out my link. It's just posted in the chat, and it's also in the YouTube and Twitch descriptions below. It's uh, meundies.com slash Frank Lepore. So 15% off your first order and free shipping and free returns. So if you're like, man, these don't fit or I don't really like these, free returns. Uh, I don't think we're past the subpocalypse. Not at all. I have not. I don't know when it's going to happen. This card seems good, right? I don't think anything else is really as good as this in this pack. That's actually this card is uh, this card is actually really good and limited. I think so. We're just getting past all the this. These seem like signs. As long as it's your turn, creatures you control get plus one plus one. Have trample. I've never seen this card. That's interesting. I wear comfy pants as socks. Figure that out. I'm not doing that. That's yeah. I'm gonna take the fire mines research. That's interesting. We could take this Piston Fist Cyclops. Or we could just take it as a Guild Gate. It's probably Piston Fist. Fire Mine seems awful. No, it's actually very good. As long as you draw one card off of it, which is very easy to do in the Is It deck, you've broken even. Goblin Papa, thank you so much for the sub. Really appreciate it. Welcome, welcome. Yeah, I'll take the Cyclops. Uh, Disdainful Stroke seems good. I like Radical Idea here. I really don't like Radical Idea in general. But it triggers two out of the three cards in our in our thing right now. I don't see us having too many Guild Gates. Yeah, I'll just take Radical Idea. Selective Snare? I don't really care about that. I think it's Disdainful Stroke. I don't... I'm not, I don't love this card. It's actually... I feel like you're going to maybe bounce like two things with it, which is not terrible, I guess. Maybe that's good. Yeah, we'll take that. I think it's more a more unique effect. Like, we can probably get a, a Disdainful Stroke where we might not get another Radical Idea. Garlic Bread, what's going on, buddy? Congrats! Way to be done with Basic. How was... So, Garlic Bread, tell us how basic was. As someone who has never been in the military. Oh, well, look, another selective snare. We'll probably see more selective snares, he says. As, or our disdainful strokes as we get another selective snare. I want to take the leapfrog here, though. Venerated locks it on unless we get uh, unless we get enough Boros Guild Gates. I don't really see that happening. I guess it's just maximize altitude.
I gotta go do the dishes. All right, Chester Pratt, enjoy the dishes, buddy. Enjoy the dishes. If that's a thing you can do. Oh, another radical idea. I'm gonna take the radical idea. Fire Urchin's cute, but I think the actual payoff for Fire Urchin is way too low. Like, if you play one spell, it's a 2-3. All right, cool. It was really challenging, but physically and mentally, I lost 25 pounds. Worst part was no frank and no garlic bread. Yeah, those are two good, these are two great tastes that take, taste great together. How would I enjoy that? <laughs> hey, man, washing the dishes can be relaxing. I actually, sometimes I'm like, it's rare, but I, sometimes I actually enjoy just hanging out in the kitchen, putting some music on and doing the dishes. Now I take my good with Wow, how dare you? How dare you? There's definitely been times where I'm just in the kitchen by myself. Oh, wow, Invert Invent comes back? All right. Well, we're doing well. Mastermind seems... Mesmerist... Mesmer, 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 this guy, no, Mastermind. Mesmerist seems fine. I don't think we want Street Riot. Firemind's research into Double Radical Idea into Piston Fist seems good. I like the content. Thanks for doing what you do. Keep with the great way. Anyway, Murray, thank you so much. Really appreciate it. I'll do what I, I do what I can. Dude, ask Asteroid. I love cleaning and cooking. It's there. It is therapeutic, right? Like, there's something relaxing about just hanging out and doing dishes or, like, just cleaning up. Like, if I feel like I have to clean because no one else will, that's infuriating to me. But if I just want to, I'm just like, you know, this could use a little touch up here. And I feel like it's, you know, we're, we're all we're all contributing equally. Then I'm like, I'm good. Let's do that. I also got some, uh, some tikka masala up in the crock pot that's cooking. So that should be ready for dinner. Some paneer. Some naan. Some rice. Citywide bust. I'm about to citywide bust. I don't think foil narco me is worth anything, but who knows, man. I bet it's actually worth less. God, narco me being a rare is such a joke. Like, what is that? What's the point of making narco me a rare? Oh, man, we don't get to help you figure out what's he. Yeah, that is usually a, a pretty common stream uh, <laughs> thing, I guess. Probably, oh, actually, is it Electromancer or is it Command the Storm here? Oh, I'm about to citywide bust. That's a, these are, these are tricky situations. I like Electromancer, especially with Radical Ideas costing one. You want Electrolyzer in multiples. Command the Storm is great and all, but this is probably going to be a million. Yeah, I like Mancer better. I mean, I think we can find more... Command the Storms. Wow. Bounty of Might and a Conclave Cavalier? God, do we just go back to Venerated... Do we just go back to Loxon now? Yikes. I think you want as many Leapfrogs as you can get to. Oh, Electromancer or Sonic Assault. Ooh. Ooh. I read and appreciate your Facebook post on life as a millennial 33, and though I've got the 9 to 5 job thing, a lot of the adulting stuff is still beyond me. I still rent, don't have a wife. For yeah, I know, same, dude. It's so weird. That's what Chat Mike does. We talk about Frank's pooping and help him decide what to eat. That's, I literally, it's it's my, it's the biggest scam ever. I only stream in order to get helpful life advice from you guys, and you just have no idea. I think it's actually Electromancer again. I want as many Electromancers as you can get, especially with Explosion in the deck. Is it Electromantis of Metal Gear Villain? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, it's Electromantis. That's that's the one. Uh, Legion Guild Mage is good. I'm not going to play it. I guess the Unexplained Disappearance is probably the only card in this pack that I would play. Uh, Passwall Adept is fine. Nothing in this pack is super exciting. But, I mean, Passwall Adept on Piston Fist Cyclops is good, I guess. If you draft four Mancer Result on a five, man. What if I don't even see four? Give 100% slugger unless it's donating blood or getting divorced. Yikes. Yikes. I don't want to second maximize altitude. That's why I didn't take it. Guild Mage's form could be good. I actually don't mind this card because if you like, it's just you could just play your 
uh, Electromancer your Piston Fist Cyclops and make them 3-3s three or 5-4, which is nice. I wish this was a gate, though. I feel like there's no reason this shouldn't be a gate, right? It's a rare. You could push it a little bit, make it a gate. Is that even pushing it? I don't know. Altitude is good, but we have one already, and we only have one Piston Fist. So I don't want to go, like, super hard on the Piston Fist. This is a late Golgari Fine Broker. I'll take the Sure Strike. I could see playing it. And absolutely nothing in this pack, unfortunately. Uh, I guess we'll just take... I can take Crushing Canopy, whatever. We can splash it off the Guild Mages for him. Citywide, Citywide bust. Guild Summit's great, but we're not in the position to take it. Every donation I donate has been donated as an Illusions Donate Donate. <laughs> oh. Well then. Is it Mesmerist? What have you even... You can get out of here, Wall. I don't think I want a second Sure Strike, but... GoatBots has so many Doom Whispers right now that they're not even buying them anymore. They're just like, no, we don't need them anymore. It's probably everyone just selling them for 10 because that's what people think they're worth and it's not actually... No one's actually buying them to play them in decks because I don't I don't think they're good, guys. I'm telling you, the card's not that good. Eh, okay. Two drops that deck. That was not supposed to be a link. <laughs> I don't. It's not. It's not a. Oh, it is. It's a link in here. I see. That's funny, actually. I have a ch a client chat. Uh, chat client rather. Uh, pretty sure it's crackling Drake here. I like direct current, but I think Drake is a little bit better for our deck. I do think it's. I I do think. Uh, I do think it's a surveil format. I think you're correct. Yeah, it's definitely Drake here. If this comes back, or if we can get another one of these, I'd be okay with it. That was another citywide bust, though. So just to be just to be clear, we've opened two citywide busts. Oh, I'm about to citywide bust. I'll take this piston fist cyclops. Oh, I thought this was another uh, explosion expansion, and I was like, oh my god, that would be amazing. I'll play two. Copy target instant sorcery spell. Yeah, so we can actually copy their removal spells, which is pretty fantastic. I wonder if the first half... I wonder if this is just good to have two of these. Probably not, but like I don't think either of these are... Actually, Demir and Farmer could be good. I could see having a 1-4 here. I get this and this confused, because they're just they're literally just cloaked Demir characters in front of walls. Eh, I'm not a huge dart fan, just in general. I don't know if that's true. I don't know. I don't mean I don't know if that makes it bad, but I'm I think we only have 10 creatures. I just rather have the one for. Oh, Book Devourer seems great here. 4 or 5 with Trample is also pretty good. It's also a May ability so you don't actually have to discard your hand, but if you go like you can engineer it so you have a bunch of lands in your hand. Oh, well, I guess I guess that's a thing. Bodyguard actually triggers most of our creatures. Double Mesmerist, double Electromancer, Passwall Adept. Uh, it doesn't trigger any of these guys, but any of the three drops, it's pretty good with. I don't think I want a second six drop. I don't care about the guild getting the two color decks. Wow. <laughs> okay. Well, we're going to take a Hypothesis here, I think. Is that better than Rampaging Monument? So you are going to probably be a 6-drop. You guys are officially X-drops. You are 6-drops. You're a 4-drop. Three. I bet one of these... I was watching your Souls video you posted, and I was surprised you were able to come off talking about films and film credits without sounding douchey. I appreciate that. Yeah, I, knew, I thought you meant credit, uh, critics there. That was my... Uh, you don't think it's close? I think you're right, actually. Especially just because we don't have many, uh, we don't have that many gold cards. One, two, three, four, six. Yeah. Lock it. Pop it and lock it. Oh, I like a Muse Drake here. And I don't care about any of you, so. We can make we can make a pretty easy cut here. Um, probably one Mesmerist. I actually kind of like the way this deck looks. 
In blue red, it's the divination of the set. What are you saying right now? Man, no one wants citywide bust. As they say in Ravnica, sizzle my nizzle, you dumb eggplant. I have no idea. What sound does a muse drake make? I don't know. Do you do you know? I can't tell if you're asking because you want to tell me or because you want me to do the impression. Guess whose awesome pizza has just arrived? Um, God, hold on. I know this one. No, I don't know. Whose? I'm about to citywide bust. I'm just gonna, now we'll take Silent Art. Just to have it. Just to, I'll just take it to have it. I want you to do the thing. What was what was the thing? I don't even remember what the thing was. That's pretty hilarious. Eh, I'll just take a thought erasure. Oh, all right. Two gateway plazas? Someone donates a Muse Drake sound. What's the Muse Drake sound? Uh, I can't, actually, was there... A, was there an established sound effect that that I did? I know you say it usually takes a dozen or more drafts to get a feel for the format. What do you like drafting most now? Uh, I don't think there's actually anything I like drafting the most. I think you actually have to really read the signals in this format. Like, we opened Vener Venerated Loxodon, but we didn't actually end up Celestia because then we got past Expansion Explosion, followed by... Um, something else, right? Something else that was pretty... pretty easy pick oh fire mines research so like then i was then i was like okay if you're gonna pass both of these i'm pretty sure you're not gonna be an is it so we can just take all the is it cards and i think it worked out pretty well Uh, we need one cut. Probably pass wall adapt. Actually, pass wall adapt just making piston fist cyclops unblockable is pretty good. We just go like radical idea into unblockable. Is book devour any good? Yeah, book devour is great. It's a four five for six and with trample, which is great stats for a, a red black red blue deck and. Uh, if you're able to... No, I, don't, I like Selective Snare. It triggers a lot of things, and also if you're able to bounce two things, it's really good. Uh, we can cut a Muse Drake, I think. Like, for two mana, you're just going to bounce a thing and trigger all your spells, right? Sometimes for one mana, if you have an Electromancer out. But I don't really, like really, really want to cut spells because we have a lot of things that uh, need spells. It's a Spells Matter format. I think this is good. A nine eight. We're just gonna go eight eight and add a forum. It's only good with three creatures, but is that good enough? Oh no, it's actually good with the Cyclops too. So it's actually good with five creatures. Yeah, that seems good enough then. We could cut Mesmerist, but I like having five creatures on two, four creatures on two. Yeah, I want. I don't want to cut any two drops. What do you think about hate drafting? I saw someone at GP Montreal draft Boris and then take Nightfall Predator so no one else can have it. Um, If you're only playing within your pod, it makes sense. It doesn't make sense, but it is like... Not wanting to play against a really strong card like Night Veil Predator is one thing, but like if you're just taking just playable cards, it's kind of silly. Also, like, don't take something that's going to make your deck act... Like, if there's something good for your deck that you actually need. Like, if I was hate draft... Like, if I was... If there was like a Hypothesis or a Night Veil, spec Night Veil Predator in the pack, I probably wouldn't hate draft the Nightfell Predator when the other card is so good. Because A, you might never play against that person. And B, they might never draw it. Right? Like, and it, it just make your deck better. Stop being a little baby about it. Make your deck better. Anyone else have said that Wizards missed a real opportunity to create a new lore character named Surveil? <laughs> wow. <laughs> and I do like that about leagues, that you are not necessarily um, likely to play people that you drafted with 
on leagues, right? Because then like it, it disincentivizes hate drafting. So you're not like, oh, I'm gonna draft this card that I saw because I don't want anyone else to have it. But you're probably not even gonna play against that person. Just build the best deck possible in your pod, right? Like. Uh, I don't think I, I don't actually think I want a radical idea here. I have no reason to add cards to my hand at this point. Whereas like every single trigger is valuable. Oh, all right. The mirror match. Oh, hey, I just got a Twitter notification live. I uh, guess as usual, that's a bit late. Yeah, the Twitch. To, so it's weird. There's no real efficient way to have it auto post to Twitter and Facebook when I go live. I use IFTTT, but that only checks like every 20 minutes or every 15 minutes, right? So I'll start at like 3.30 or actually I went live at like 3.05 and then IFTTT will only check every 30 minutes or so. So if it just checked, it's weird. I hate Twitch notifications tonight. Every single time it's like it works so it buzzes my phone. Oh man, not one whole phone buzz. But the other thing is, if you guys want to use Twitch notifications, you can actually go into your settings and uh, turn on or off whoever you want to get notifications from, right? Like, I think we just play Leapfrog here. Hopefully in the bath. <laughs> uh, I was hoping this wasn't. A, I was like, do these share? And I'm like, once I saw Wall, I was like, there's no way they share. But maybe. Us white collar workers sometimes have strict relations on phone use of work. I can't even look at my phone basically ever. The only reason I knew this was happening is because I'm working from home. Okay, but how did you get a Twitch notification? Does, do you mean just check or a Twitter notification rather? So did you just check Twitter? Because if that's the if that's the case, then yeah, I get that. Huh. Wonder what happens here. I'm just gonna maximize altitude here. Because we can replay this guy if we This is a good this is a good thing that's happening. And I was like, oh hey, this guy needs some onion some onions. No one needs onions. There, I don't want to always yield to this. You got it. All my floaty boys. I'm tempted to just bounce this guy. I like that. Food would be awful if onions didn't exist. I agree with you. I moved in with my friend after breaking up the next, so this bath is pretty gross even after... Oh, dang. Oh, dang. That's the worst, man. When you can't control, like, the quality of the, uh, the living conditions that you're forced into. Ain't nobody got time for that. Oh, another leapfrog? Good deal. I'm going to keep the form in hand because we do want to start discarding things to uh, Radical Idea. Radical! Food would be off. Yeah, I read, I read that one already. It's <laughs> like, oh, let me read this again. Okay. All right, there's Electrosmancer. People all over the world. Electromance. Oh god, I hate when I do that. I dropped my phone. I have to I have to schedule a haircut. So I keep messaging the haircut. My haircut lady. Haircut lady. 
Who's that haircut lady? Kelsey, thank you so much for the resub. Welcome back. Hey, Frank, didn't really want to do Twitch, but I love watching your YouTube videos in the wee hours when I should be studying. Thanks for the great content. Thank you so much. Man, If when you guys actually come from YouTube just to subscribe on Twitch, even if you don't catch Twitch, super, ple super pleasant. Really appreciate that kind of support. The jump spell does have jump start. All the spells we have played except for a snare have jump start so far. This would be pretty bad if it didn't, because you only get like one use out of it. Stop tapping down my Cyclops. You're being very rude. Oh, they're gonna radical idea too. A uh, radical idea in response. Look at that. Look at that hungry boy. All right, I don't think we're dead here. However, I have a good feeling about our our odds here, right? We had a lot of power on the board. They're at four. Pretty much two of these guys are lethal. Maybe. Ooh, don't have any. Don't don't have no plays. I really could catch you live, but I wanted I watched about a year and decided to download Twitch just to subscribe. Thank you, man. That's so. I really appreciate that. That's good stuff. We won the game. Oh, we would have had a Drake coming down, and we could have made it a made it a plus one plus one boy. I don't think any of these are good. I think we're fine. I'm making sauerkraut and prick ribs from my dad for my dad for dinner because it's one of his favorite. And it's not a rough ghost since my grandpa. Oh, man, man, pernicious dude. Grandpa passed my Saturday. I'm so sorry, buddy. And usually it doesn't smell all that great, but for some reason today it smells awesome. Enjoy them prick ribs. <laughs> I'm making fun of your typo. <laughs> Glad I can be pleasant. I'll watch you guys later. I'm in a super boring lab right now, and I don't think the TA appreciates you as much as I <laughs> Yeah, enjoy enjoy that education. Also, my girlfriend didn't like that I would always talk to the screen when I could just get Twitch and put my... <laughs> Why don't you just tell him in the chat? Stop telling him he's making the wrong play and just download the client. The, the prick ribs are the People's Republic of Korea ribs. Just so you guys know. This feels like the right thing to do. Oh, I'm going to keep that. Oh, that's a nice boy. What if we add a gold uh, to... Does it come with a play with a plus one, plus one counter, you think? Who's that lady? <laughs> Can you stop talking to the screen? All right, let's do it. Let's do it. I also love it when people are like, man, I just tried to pause the stream and that doesn't work that way. No blocks. We Dragonauts. Thoughts on a 13 pick Rubble Belt Boar? Is that the 3-3 that gives plus 2 plus 0? I don't love that guy. Uh, however, I don't think it's bad either. I actually don't know why that card's uncommon. Maybe that makes me a dummy. Come and knock on our door. I also ordered some new luggage because I really needed new luggage and I haven't actually uh, bought new luggage for like 15 years. So I got a new suitcase. Also, like I said, if you guys are going to be in Grand Prix Denver this weekend, say hey. Say hey. I'll also have my cube with me. I'm going to bring my cube, so I'm actually tempted to see if we can get a cube draft together. Maybe me and a bunch of a bunch of streaming streamy boys. If that would interest anybody. What 
what's it gonna be? It's an exciting land. We're at 10 already. God, the Izzet deck can deal so much damage. I bet you get a cube draft in November. What is that? Oh, yeah, we're definitely cube drafting in November, dude. I mean, if I if we didn't, I'd be actually really sad. Charlie Wayne, thank you so much for the sub. Really appreciate it. Welcome, welcome. Mike ECJB, thank you so much for the sub. Really appreciate it. Welcome, welcome. All right, we can't block one, two, three, four, five. We go to four here. Yikes. What in the earth? Is this, are we just dead? I think they Sonic Assault and we're just dead, right? Wow. Wow. <laughs> That's ridiculous. Yikes. I just checked the price of my deck at MTGO. Does that mean it's cheap or expensive? I can't tell. I can't tell if you're sad because your deck lost value or if you're sad because it's too expensive to buy on MTGO. This hand looks great. Turn two, turn three, maybe turn four. I'm sad. Okay, you don't have to yell, handy handy capable gamer. You don't have to yell, buddy. We're all friends here. I thought the deck was Jabe. This guy's coming down. You could bounce our two wizards. Yeah, that's true. But we were dead, so. Uh, we died. Actually, yeah, we Dragonauts is a wizard. That's interesting. Yeah, this guy's better than this guy when we can pump this guy next turn. Or this turn? Next turn? This turn? I Oh, I love that meme. That's probably one of my favorite memes. The Roseanne meme. I thought the deck was white. Look at me screaming at this guy. I apparently have caps on. It's okay. Are you still taking suggestions? Uh, yes, I will always be su taking suggestions. For those in the, if you're watching on YouTube, uh, I will always be taking Patreon suggestions because I will always be looking to improve the content there. So if you guys have any suggestions, shout them at me. Shout them, shout them out loud. I suggest more Mike. Mike, let's do a podcast together. You and I can do a podcast. You can be the Blizzard guy and I'll be the Magic guy. We can call it Blizzard Wizards. Bwiz Wizards. And it can be about Overwatch and Magic. And Mike will be like, I don't even really play that much Overwatch, even though I... Even though I work on the, the game. Okay, so basically... Neither of these do things that we care about right now. We can't kill them yet. We could sure strike this guy. Give this guy flying. Yeah, we're going to do this. Look at that. I overpaid. That's how good I am at this game. And then... You're going to get pumped on the ground... There we go. What order do you recommend contributing? I do Patreon 5 
tier as I mostly watch YouTube and only Twitch when I can. What do you mean? What order to recommend? What? Explain your. Explain yourself. Oh, that'll do. So they have a block here. They take seven, go to five. Good games. Our deck is sweet. Oh no, did it just happen? Oh no, we're down to 494. That's actually still pretty good. However, I think there's another hit coming. I could have copied the Sure Strike. Actually, it's true. I think I was too excited about uh, the potential of having Sphinx's Rev in hand. 494 is still pretty good. But we do have to remain above 500 for that uh, for the better Twitch revenue sh split. So that's what we're trying to that's what we're trying to accomplish here. That's so funny that it just dropped from like 494 to 5 570 580 to 494. That's pretty funny. I am going to keep this hand. Bodyguard and Demir Informant's pretty good. I will sm I will flash you a dreamy smile. I don't know if that's dreamy or not, but Is that good? I can't tell. How far away is the GP from Columbus, Ohio? You know, I don't know. I bet it's drivable. Ohio to Denver? Everything's drivable. If you believe. Nightmarish smile? That was less dreamy. More, what if I... I could do a Nicolas Cage smile. Just resubbed after watching your MTGO. You can eat my... <laughs> Love it. Fight the flood. Screw for it. Man, it's so hard. It's so hard, but I I really appreciate it. Kerwit, thank you so much, buddy. First after the apocalypse. Someone had to do it. What do I discard here? Just a land, probably. All these other cards are very, very good. I'll get rid of a guild gauge. Guild mages for him. How far along are... Actually, I'm going to put both of these in the graveyard. I don't want either of these things. I want lands. How far? How close are we to devouring the, the Japanese candy box? Not too... We're probably halfway through, I think. If Mike wants to stream both tomorrow and Wednesday, we can probably finish it off those days. But, I've, like I said, I've been waiting until we're able to... Well, that's not bad, I guess. Ba -da 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 -da. Oh, that's a desperation move right there. <laughs> this guy is so woke. By all means, take another step toward the captain. Oh, wow, that's really, that's aggressive. Go for it. See what happens. Ping me with what you need to do. Oh, that's really sad. Why would you do that? Wow, that's rude. Well, fascinating. <laughs> that is some aggressive flavor. I'm like, buddy, you can't even attack or block by yourself. You need a friend. And you're going to get all aggressive about it? Please. This really isn't worth getting rid of. I'm tempted to unexplain disappearance around Guy and then just replay him. I think that's good. I don't care about you. Have you tried playing Gruesome Menagerie in Standard yet? No, not yet. MCG Loop, feel free to send me a deck. Feel free to send me a list if you want to take a look at it. 
because that sounds interesting. All right, I'm covered in the barista patina of coffee, sweat, and sadness. I'm going to take a shower and go outside and think about birds or something. Juposhi, have a good afternoon, buddy. I'll see you again sometime. Also, are you a barista? I've been a barista for about seven years of my life in total. I worked at a Borders Cafe back when they were still around for two years, and then I worked at Starbucks at varying points in my life for about five years total. I have seven years of barista experience. Look at all these pumpable guys they have. What's up, Buddy Lee? What's up, Spicy Jalapeno? Uh, yeah, that's fine. I actually targeted this guy. I'm like, oh, that doesn't work. I'll discard a radical idea and kill this guy. See you later. Bye. Yeah, I don't know. I like the um, I like the craft, right? I don't drink. I don't actually drink coffee. I don't mind it. I just I'm not a big coffee fan, and uh, I appreciate the craft of coffee. You know, does that make sense? Like the uh, the drink making. There's something artisanal about it. Like it's the same thing. Like like bartending. It's a, I think it's a craft, and I like I actually like that that aspect of it. Being able to pull shots of espresso or you know what have you. Oh, that's a good one. I guess we just play Cyclops here. Elk war Elf Warrior, Fungus, Zombie, Rat. Alright, so none of these are... I became a fiend for the bean, if you know what I mean. That was not intended to rhyme, but it did. So, there you go. No attacks. How do you stay awake in the morning or the afternoon? Y'all, you know, I I get a full night's rest. That's rude. Is this really where you want to be? When Jesus comes back? Did you catch Venom over the weekend? No, I'm probably going tomorrow. Because AMC has $5 tickets on Tuesday. Oh, we actually could have copied that and killed this guy. God, I always forget that. But really, do I want to do that when I have just like... Well, I'm less inclined to not do this now. Let's do this. Oh, cool. We could play a Leapfrog and play a land. And then next turn, if we hit a land, we can actually Explosion for four draw four kill this guy that seems real good oh because it's four or less you're right we could not have copied it yeah it's it's a rare so i expected you to be able to copy anything but apparently not i wonder why that's interesting yeah that's a good one that's a good dude they got two creatures in the graveyard sure Six six with vigilance. All right, so now we're actually going to try to kill this guy. I think we actually just double block here, because this is actually going to be hard to deal with. Actually, it's only a four four, right? Maybe we just take six. We go to eleven. We kill this guy. Five venomous bucks for the movie, non poisoning. <laughs> 
Appreciate it. Although if you wanted to poison me, you had a very good opportunity with your Japanese candy box. Yeah, I don't think so. I think we're just going to take six here. We'll go to 11. We can forever block this guy. That's what we wanted to see. All right. So we're going to explosion you. Choose target player. Target player draws cards. Me. Draw four. Kill your guy. Seems great. That's the world I want to live in. Well, three of them were lands. Okie dokie. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Yikes. There are six lands on our 15 card deck. Ooh, not ideal. How highly do I think of the Grixis list that I posted on YouTube? Uh, I liked it a lot. I had fun playing it. It felt powerful. Uh, you have answers to Teferi. You have a lot of counter spells. You have really resilient threats. You get to play Nicol Bolas and Niv-Mizzet. I have no uh, no real reservations about the deck. So thankfully we have Radical Idea, Radical Idea in the graveyard. I think that's all we have. Okay, well, now you're just being a dick. Can I post a link? I found a real surveil and made a card. Yeah, definitely. Knock yourself out. I always appreciate when people ask if they can post links. Also, just because the chat mentioned it, I will let you guys know that I am sponsored by MeUndies currently, and this is my first day really advertising for them. Um, and they're very soft. These are these are unworn, just so you guys know. These are unworn boxers. Um, but yeah, if you guys are looking for new underwear, new shirts, uh, socks, lounge pants, anything like that, you can check out the link in the description or the one that was just posted in the chat. You get 15% off and free shipping and returns. So, And also, you can use that link and it will give you... Uh, it gives me... Um, what do you call it? It's called a conversion in the biz. Okay, well, let's... Radical ideas here. It's a lot of lands we got. Okay, still still a lot of lands. <sighs> Having a good time. Well, I'm not modeling the underwear per se. I'm just kind of... Okay, so 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 lands. Seems good. Why can't you win the game? I don't know. I imagine it's to do with the 14 lands. Yeah, this is pretty bad for us. 3-3 three, three blocks, 2-2, two, two, we take 4-5. Yeah, we're probably dead here. Like, we had, to, we had to put in the graveyard this guy, this guy, this guy. We had to, we didn't have to, but, like, otherwise the option is um, just not drawing lands, right? So now we draw the lands. So wait, if we buy from that link, do we get some sign previously worn by? No. No, you do not. No, you do not. I promise that all underwear or any any clothing items that you purchase from MeUndies will be 100% new and unworn. Uh, whether or not that is a perk for you or not, I don't know. But that is a guarantee I will make. Digital Caveman, thank you so much. Really appreciate the, the sub. Welcome back. Yep, this is how death works. So block you, block you. And then we take five anyway. Yeah, we, there's no way we can block all the four guys. We can block here and here, and then just, like, it's super bad anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Oh, did we, did we actually draw 16 lands? Jesus. So there's one land in our 11 cards. Is that true? I did forget to count the guild mages for him because it's gold, so. Any constructed today? Not that I th not that I know of. Not that I'm, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not feeling it, but 
Remember the other day when you were asking what content would be interested in seeing on your page, and the answer is you modeling your new sponsor. Oh boy, oh boy, we're having a good time. Bodyguard could block a different guy than Drake. That's not how that works. Bodyguard doesn't have to block the same creature. It just can't attack or block alone. They make sure it's come one. I don't know what you're saying right now. You should get some X damage spells. Hmm. Uh, I don't know if there will be Frank Laporte themed undies available. I'm gonna have to err on the. I'm gonna. I'm gonna default to saying no. Uh, however, there are currently Star Wars underwear, which is which are pretty sweet. They make shirts. Come one corrected to where i don't know what i don't know what where what word is where supposed to be correcting i will play first i like this hand do 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 do, 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 do. Matthew Ori, what are you what are you you okay, Matthew Ori? You're getting angry. <laughs> Matthew Ori's like, how long have you been live? I go I mean like if you guys get email notifications or Twitch notifications, you should be fine, right? Make sure to turn those on. Turn those email and Twitch notifications on so you know when I'm here. And then we can hang out and then there's no problems, right? Oh really? This is how you're gonna be? With your little rat boy. Rat boy. This guy. Use all of this. Sir, tell me I can sign on these for my favorite. That's, that is correct. That is what I'm telling you. I hope that's not a deal breaker for you. But seriously, I bet you guys need, uh, I bet you guys need, <laughs> so I bet you guys need new underwear. But then, like, the more I thought about that, I'm like, why do I think that? And like, hmm, I don't know. Does he say you don't know what you're doing? I thought he said you're going away too, rat boy. Well, I didn't say rat boy. I never, I don't think he said you don't know what you're doing. Interesting. Now I have to look that up. You're going to wait till... Oh, you're going to wait till. Okay, so we're kind of both on it. Like, I thought it was you're going away to, and it's you're actually, you're going to wait till, fat boy. Fat boy, wait till tomorrow. And it's, uh, yeah, we're talking about silver chair. Oh, that's a good one. Let's get in there with our 4-3. Read my last comment. God, Matthew, you're so, you're so aggressive. You know how they have Elf on the Shelf and the new version is Doll on the Yeah, I saw that actually. I'm not okay with that. Also, Doll in the Hall is like, they're really stretching the rhymes here. Yeah, that's fine. Do we like selective snaring this guy, attacking for four, and then. Yeah, I think we do. I feel like, cause I feel like uh, you don't know what you're doing. It doesn't even fit. You don't know what you're doing. Like you really have to really, you really have to compress those words to like have it fit in the in the song. Well, you only deal four, which is unfor unfortunate. Maximize altitude. 
Any land is good because we got this dude in hand, so I'm okay with that. <laughs> uh, the old Mario Party and uh, Frank stream. I'm okay with it. Guess we're getting in there with this guy. I'm muting you to listen to Silver Chair real quick. I accept. Oh, the the subpocalypse down to four forty one. Yeah, that was the that was the second half. Yep, there might be there might be a third hit too. Unfortunately, uh, it's rough. Nothing I want to discard. If we get an extra land or... Actually, you can't discard a land with this guy. Um, we're just going to keep playing lands because this is... The bigger this is, the better we're, we're doing there. If we can just get to five, then we can kill this guy and draw five, which is actually pretty nuts. Because then our attacks are also very, very good. What's up, Gosmit? I think we are above 400, but... Well, so, like, it was at 589 or 5... What was where were we at today when we started? 581, 582? And there was 172 gifted, which puts us to 409. Um, however, I know a bunch of those people also resubbed, so... Um... Yeah, now we're just going to do it for four. Sure. Because even if they have plus three, plus three, it's only... It's still dead. I was watching a draft video where you were talking about Dr. Doom. What would be a good model of an elevator from Thanos? What do you think about Annihilus? I don't think Annihilus is a big enough villain. It's, it's, it's not well known and he's not iconic enough. I love Annihilus, don't get me wrong. Um, I like that you said Annihilus from the negative zone. Uh, which Annihilus do you mean? Uh, let's go choose any target. This guy and me. Sizzle kills it, but like we have to discard a card. And if we draw two lands off of Hypothesis, we just don't get to do that. Frank, watching the stream on TV, so I'm just popping in a say hello and going back to cooking. Scorch Skid, thank you so much, buddy. Really appreciate it. Enjoy the cooking. Cooking is good stuff. I'm also cooking. Ooh, a book devourer. I like keeping all these lands and then cycling them with book devourer. This guy's now a threat. What are you going to do now? Nothing. Be a 4-4. Yes. So I think we can discard Sure Strike. Actually, we'll probably discard one of these idiots. Yeah, I think getting one of these guys is fine. I guess we'll play a land, just so we can play this guy. It's your boy. Little Leap. Could you read Hypothesis in a Snoop Dogg voice? I don't know. I don't know if there is a Snoop. Hey, y'all. It's a Hypothesis. I can't. I don't know if there's a... Hey y'all, what's Crackalackin? I don't I don't know if there's a good Snoop Dogg voice. Oh, 10 ad bits. I'm okay with it. Element Jer, thank you so much, buddy. Appreciate it. Could have meant Annihilus from the positive zone. You know, I guess you're right. I guess you're right. Uh Leapy Boy. Pass Wally Boy. I think we could just take six here. So I do hear you're gonna wait too, but now. Now, but I always assumed it was some weird grungy Australian accent. That's weird. I feel like you really got to reach to uh, 
One, two, three, five. It's like they're just going to leapfrog Book Devourer. Even if we don't attack with this guy. Or even if we don't cycle our hand, rather, it's still good value. Crackalack and Drake on the Rizzle, my hypothesis. -le. Do I just trade here? I think this is a fine trade. <sighs> well, it's less of a trade now. But that's fine. Got a lot of floaty boys here. Sure strike on here might just kill you if you don't have an instant speed removal spell. Let's well, radical ideas. Oh, interesting. Sure strike on you. How much is this? Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and they all float. That'll do, pig. That'll do. Man, this apocalypse finally happened. I'm so sad. But also grateful. So I got that. When does Snoop why does Snoop Dogg always Oh my god, not the Snoop Dogg joke. MTG loop, go for it. Knock yourself out. Link away. <laughs> Good old float frog. Oh, I like Firemind's research on turn two. This is this is great. Overlord Nate, thank you so much for the resub. Welcome back, buddy. Really appreciate it. Oh yes. Oh yes. This is gonna do it. Is this any target? Oh, any target, boy. That's nice. As a survivor of this apocalypse, I'm just trying to do my part to make it. <laughs> Appreciate it. Preach. I'm glad you guys, I'm glad everyone here is here. I'm glad everyone is here and safe during this apocalypse. Oh, that was a good draw. Come on. Come on with the good draws. Get up. Come on. Get up with the good draws. That's from, uh, Disturbed. I don't know if you guys have heard of Disturbed. They're a, a local indie band from... Uh... Oh, no attack, huh? That's fascinating to me. Have you read uh, the, Annihilation story, uh, the Annihilation story arc? I don't think so. I've read the one where Johnny Storm dies. I've read most of Jonathan Hickman's Fantastic Four, which is just fantastic. Get up, come on, get down with the sickness. Oh, they're not. Oh, they missed a land drop. Brutal. Can I bounce this guy? I mean, I can, obviously. Always yield to that guy. Just kidding. I don't know how to read. <laughs> fantastic. That's just fantastic. Jay Sizzle, thanks so much for the gift sub. Really appreciate it. Kagara, welcome, welcome. On a scale of one to five, or four maybe? Yeah, yeah probably. It's uh, That sounds good. All right, let's see what happens here. Which one of these guys is set to, set to die? Hungry Howie bought with the resub. Oh, man, such consistent crust. Oh, can I undo this? Oh, they couldn't. They didn't kill this, though, which is good. All right. That will be your downfall, good sir. All 
I would probably say main deck duress, but I would Frank would probably say main deck duress, but I disagree. How dare you? Hmm. Let me open up this link. Look at this idiot. Let's have some radical ideas here. Yes. Crackling Drake. That was a that was a land. C -c -c crackling Drake. Look with your floaty boys. So this is seven mana if we discard the seven seventh land, so we get three damage from we could actually discard it to Radical Ideas, putting this up to four. Yeah, we'll take four. Yikes. That's a lot of four four bros. Four five bros. Discard you. Mm, that's actually pretty okay, I think. So we can actually go Sure Strike on this guy. Attack for five. Put a counter on this. Kill this guy. I doubt they're blocking, so. Saturday Night's Elk Tears, Hungry Howie's Chat, Takeover was fair. Oh, that was hilarious. I agree with you. What have we here? Ooh, Graveyard and... Oh, I wish this was five damage, though. We still have to keep it. Graveyard, top of library. Pretty sure we're just chump blocking here, one of these guys. Did you see those new judge promos? I have not seen the new judge promos. Pelt Collector being $9 in paper is pretty comical. Yeah, I'm come on, get down with the sickness. Oh, I saw the Lord of Atlantis, but I think that's the only one. Uh, we can also just draw two cards as well, but I think getting rid of one of these guys is probably preferable, even though they have five cards in hand. Where are my big threats? Where are my crackling drakes and my piston piston boys? Yep. Yep. Well, those piston boys are at it again. So we can draw two, discard Sure Strike if we want to, kill one of these things, probably you. And if we hit a land, we get to kill another one of these guys, which is nice. We could also just try to burn their face off. And we did not hit a land. Wow, that's amazing. Jesus. Seven lands would have also been nice because then next turn we have four, but I don't think that. Four, eight. Selective Snare is great against both these guys next turn, though. Let's get rid of Sure Strike. I think it's the strongest thing to get rid of here. Mm. 
And next turn, if we hit a land, we take 10 here. That seems bad. I'm just going to hold this back in case we want to block the Gorgon. This guy seems huge now. So we got one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, that's pretty big. Probably just mm, going to take eight. I think going to four is safe here. Come on, get up. I hope they play another Devourer of Dowser of Lights. That would be nice. I would be super thrilled about that. Oh, dang it. Oh, it's so bad. God, does it have to be this? Drake is a really good threat here. Can we win somehow, right? Like, puts them to, this puts them to six, right? It takes two mana. One, two, three, four. We're never going to be able to cast this. We have to hit another land to snare, though. Oh, it's so brutal. I don't think we have time for that. Yep. That's pretty sad. One land. All right. That'll do. That's an eight four, good buddy. Not actually attacking with anything here. As long as we can dodge a removal spell for this guy, I think we win. But boy, that's a hard... Like, they have two deadly deadly visits. Is that what they're called? Yeah, I feel like this guy's dead. <sighs> Maximize altitude gives us one more shot. Yep, feel like this is what you have to do. Block here. Any pump spell kills us if we don't block. If they have a pump spell, we're dead, so we have to block. Uh, if they have something like dead weight, this doesn't kill us. How do they have five? Oh, they have two of the, the guys in hand, that's why. I was like, how do they have five cards in hand? If they had double dead weight, this guy dies already, and they probably would have played that pre-combat. If they had a removal spell, they probably would have played that pre-combat. Necrotic wound. I mean, that's going to kill our guys anyway, so we're probably just dead here. Yep. That's pretty good. One, two, three. Oh, it would have only dealt three. Oh, my God. All we had to do was not block. I mean, we were playing around not Necrotic Wound. We were playing around Pump Spell. Oh, that's so bad. But now they have one more Dowser of Lights in hand. <sighs> I wish, God, if we didn't block, I think we win this game. All we had to do is take one from the rat. Why even block the rat? Oh, God, just take the one. It was so bad. And we are out of things. Yep, that was bad. That was so dumb. That was my own fault. Ugh, I'm so mad at myself. 
We just had no reason to block there. I was playing around plus three, plus three, right? So if they have plus three, plus three, which we did, I don't think we saw, then they kill us with the rat. So I just wanted to make sure we don't die to that. And we played around that, and we played around dead weight. We didn't play around neg three, neg three. That's why we did it. Okay, so I feel less bad knowing that I actually had reason to do it, but I still wish. Arr, I'm still frustrated. Oh my god, another is it mirror match? Jeez. Jeez. Well, we were hoping for a blue there. I will take any land off the top, but... Of course we don't. This is how it, this is how it goes, huh? Okay. Yep. And I wonder why games with uh, resource systems that don't disallow you to play the game are seeing more popularity. Okay, cool. All right. Get a game loss, I guess. <laughs> Let's start with a game loss. Seems good. Strong deck. Alright, this is a hand. This is a hand. <laughs> but it was not GG, it was BG. Yeah, that's that's pretty much how it goes. Oh man, the perfect curve. Get to play our 0-4 on turn four. Perfect. Oh, yours is better. Which means I will likely attack. Trades these? Whoa, really? I was not expecting that. Watch, they have another one. Okay. I accept. Metro PCS sends me all these automated texts and I just responded, you're my only friend, Metro, and they replied, sorry, this service is not available. <laughs> oh, man, that's good stuff. I'll trade here, too. Are you just going to trade all your stuff for all my stuff? No? Okay. Just making sure. Now we know. <sighs> oh, look at that little guy. Oh, 
Oh, I like the way this is worded. It's not a trigger. It just says as long as you've cast an instant spell this turn, you can attack. That's nice. Yeah, this is fine. We can be a little more aggressive. Four five seems pretty big against the blue red deck. Where are all their spells? What's going on right now? Hey man, where are your spells at? Do I just drop the book devour? Nobody knows it. They just counter it. I'm just going to play terrible spells and hope they... Oh, that's a good one. See if they want to do counter this guy. I'm expecting, like, Devious or Ionize. I don't know what that card's called, the four mana one. And that one's good, too. I accept. Actually, I thought today was Indigenous People Day. Isn't that more accurate? They trade here? Yeah, let's do that. If you want to trade here, I'm fine with it. I feel pretty ahead. Piston into Piston? Deal. Do you have Sure Strike? Maybe. Uh, sure. According to the federal holiday calendar, it's still calling weird. Weird. The Columbus being a maniac thing has been pretty thoroughly debunked. He was he wasn't a good dude. Most of the worst rumors about him aren't true. Interesting. I would be uh, intrigued to read about that. Look at that guy. That guy's just raging. I'm not thrilled with this hand because we are out of spells. So I'll just play four or five. And then get in there for dose. Dosey do. Oh, I don't have a disdainful stroke. Yeah, one card. I think this game's over. Admiral Praxis, what's going on, buddy? Keeping this island so that we can discard it to Book Devour if this guy ends up dealing some combat damage. Is he raging at the world, at his family, at himself, or is he just... Who are we talking about? Oh, the mon... Oh, it's Rampaging, not Raging. Did I say Raging Monument? I meant Rampaging Monument. But either way, he's probably still pretty angry. So let's talk about your problems, Monument. What's, uh, what's going on there? Wow, that was rude. I guess we'll take 10 here. And if we play any spell, we get to kill you. Yep, that's not a spell. One time. Nope, that's not it either. Yikes. I guess we could have played this first, but then like... We're really limited in what we're able to cast. All right, we'll keep you on top. We'll put you in the graveyard. Any one spell. Any spell at all. Ah, we should have put it in the graveyard. I'm so bad at this game. Ah. Uh, what an absolute idiot. Oh, my God. I can't believe I did that. If the Oh, my God. It's graveyard. I thought it was scry. I'm getting scry confused with surveil because there's so many things happening in magic. Oh, I'm so stupid. I hate myself. 
How many games can I throw away on this on this video? That's that's the question. We're gonna go with one right now. So far, it's only been one. It definitely qualifies as a punt. Hundred percent a punt. Uh, I'll take four here, and I'm assuming you don't have another thing. Oh my god, we left the hypothesis on top. That's so stupid. I was so excited about it. Yeah, that's still game. Oh my god. They're probably just laughing at me. I would be. Um, yeah, let's get rid of this guy. Kill this guy. Now we have two floaty boys. So bad. He's like, if you knew that was on top, why didn't you just keep it in the graveyard? It's okay. We got more information. We got to see this. So it's all good. Totally meant to do that. I like Wall of Mist here because it does block most of the things. It blocks the monument. It blocks the... I can take Mesmerist out. I don't care about that. Um, geez, I can't believe we did that. I'm so, I'm like kicking myself here. What a stupid idiot. And for those who are like, you know, it's always variance. It's never because you're just misplaying. No, it's definitely not variance there. That was just me being stupid. Yeah, I think that's the only change I want to make. I don't care about the second Muse Drake. I don't care about the Lockets or the Maniacal Rage, so... I just wanted more information, that's all. Recovered possession on the next play. Fantastic. No, but seriously, these are like the softest underwear I've ever actually felt before. It's pretty incredible. You guys should check them out for yourselves. Don't beat yourself up over a mistake. You're on the internet. There are plenty of people who do it for you. That's fair. That's fair. I will keep this hand. All right. Let's try to have a game three where uh, we can actually play Magic the Gathering. Let me get a two drop. Can you show us your underwear? Can you show us your underwear you were talking? It's right here. Right here. Some some me undies. Super these are these are clean, have not been worn. Very very soft, very comfortable. Two drop. Yeah, three drop, huh? Okay. But okay. What happened there? 12 bones. Hungry Howie's bot. Like shaking savory seasonings on our flavored crust. Shake off the games and enjoy the next draft. Courtesy of Hungry Howie's, the pizza that pairs best. <laughs> oh my god. Is it the pizza that pairs best with me undies? Is that is that true? I'm not actually sure. It's hard to say. Do we play Demir Informant or Piston Fist Cyclops? I guess it depends on what they do. Probably Cyclops now. This doesn't block here, but this blocks both. So, yeah, let's do that. Are they soft enough to wear under my head? 100%. I will 100% wear them on my head. Oh my god, but then they said they're un- wow, that's- that's super awkward. You guys are- you guys are telling jokes here, but then they're actually like, kind of awkward when you get to think about them. Four, five, six, seven, eight. That's cool. Just take casual eight damage here. Sonic Assault is pretty busted, I think. I don't care about either of these. This one goes out to the one I love. 
Simple prop to occupy my time. This one goes out to the one I love. Now this is going to be in my head forever. Yeah, I don't think we're winning this game. Being at 10 when they have Sonic Assault in the graveyard is pretty bad. Although we do have profitable blocks. Block here, block here, block here. So, What do you think is the strongest guild in draft? I think they're all actually pretty good. I think it just depends on what you open and what you're past. Like you're able to... Um, like the Boros deck... Like, like we opened uh, Venerable Loxodon, which is great. But then we got past a really solid Is it deck. So, Which we'd be doing very well here if it wasn't for... Uh, having... No, a wall of mist. We can keep up invert. They tap our book devour. They attack with everything. We go to eight, but then we actually get to profitably block some things. I'm just going to tap the Book Devourer, right? Switching Power and Toughness doesn't do anything against this board. This guy being a 5-5 is really frustrating. I think we just have to play this guy on the board. Like, they're going to Sonic Assault and tap it. It's, it is what it is. Oh, wow. That's infinitely worse. Holy shit. Well, I guess we're just dead. <sighs> yep. Pretty good. Two cards in hand. One has to be a Disdainful Stroke. And they've seen like two spells that are Disdainful Strokeable. I guess they saw Crackling Drake too, but... All in all, we have not played that many four more casting cost spells. Yep, 5-5. Five, five. This guy becomes a 6-6, six, six and we're already going to, to 8. Yeah, this is going to end well. Wow. Nope, definitely not taking 4 from that. Yep, pretty sure we're not going to win this draft. That's for sure. Interesting. I guess we'll go to 4 here. I haven't seen you magicking recently. Maybe I just don't keep up. So very good to see you stream. I've been streaming MTG for every single day, five days a week for the past year. So I don't know where you, I don't know how you could have missed me, but here we are. Yeah, we're basically dead, right? They tap down this guy, they attack, we block here, we take four and we're at two. All right. Well, this draft did not go anywhere near as well as we wanted it to. We punted a game in round two, which could have cost us two packs, but, uh, yeah, and then we got mana screwed in the first game of round three, which meant we only got to we only had to, we had to win two matches. Our opponent had to win one. So, what can you do? Thank you guys so much for watching. Really appreciate it. Send those like and subscribe buttons. If you are interested in supporting the stream, you can check out MeUndies or my Patreon page or Twitch. Links are all in the description below. You get fifteen percent off your first order and free shipping in returns. So, uh, hopefully you guys check that out, and I'll see you guys next time. Thanks a lot. Really appreciate it.